Keep your hands apart, not clapping, for Florida Congressman Matt Gates. Saturday Night Live focused on the controversy swirling around Republican Congressman Matt Gates in its April 3rd episode. Uh, my name is uh, Matt Gates, like Bill Gates, but uh, with a Z at the end, like a cool version for teens. Speaking of teens. <laughs> oh, we don't have to speak of teens. No, no. <laughs> let's. Gates was played by cast member Pete Davidson in the show's cold open. Gates is under investigation by the Justice Department for a number of crimes, including child sex trafficking and allegedly paying for sex. Gates went on Tucker Carlson tonight the week the news broke to defend himself. What is happening is an extortion of me and my family involving a former Department of Justice official. Representative Matt Gates, who looks like a caricature artist drawing of me, <laughs> is reportedly under investigation for an alleged sexual relationship with an underage girl because Gates believes that only voters should have to show ID. Weekend Update co-host Colin Jost also addressed the allegations against the Florida representative. Gates then defended himself, releasing this very normal statement. See if any of it sounds suspicious to you. Matt Gates has never paid for sex. Matt Gates has never ever been on any such websites whatsoever. Matt Gates cherishes the relationships in his past and looks forward to marrying the love of his life. Here's the craziest part of this story to me. A sitting congressman is being accused of child trafficking and the QAnon people are suddenly like, nah, I need more evidence. <laughs> that was your whole thing. Gates was a loyal supporter of former President Trump. Trump, who endorsed Gates in 2018, hasn't come to Gates's rescue in recent days. People are just targeting me because I defended Donald Trump. And what has Trump said in your defense? Uh, giggity squat. 